Well guys, I uh, didn't bring the GoPro. We've been swamped at work. Uh, had a natural gas emergency and uh, we're basically working as much as we can to get uh, get people back in gas. But managed to get a break for a couple hours, come home and of course the compass set connected. Of course I don't have, like I said, I don't have the GoPro. I'm actually out here snapping all my traps because I'm not going to be able to check them for the foreseeable future. So this probably, probably will end trapping season for me, which puts me at 16 coyotes. I kind of feel horrible that this guy's been sitting out here all day. Let's see if we can get him to talk a little bit. He's not going to talk. But young coyote. <sighs> Situation just sucks, man. I really want to keep trapping but you know work gets in the way let's walk over here and see if we got any tunes before i sign off on this one it's been a it's been a bitch basically our our medium pressure natural gas line has a ton of water in it figure out where the water's coming from. That's no good at all. That coon trap is actually underwater. So I'll have to find it. I don't see any fur, so I'm sure there's not a coon attached to it. I know it's wired off to that root down there but guys it, like I said it sucks but it is what it is but we got to finish up with one nice muddy coyote I'll go home and get him at least get him skinned and washed before I have to go back into work tonight make some of that big double time money Appreciate y'all watching, and we'll we'll uh, we'll come back with some episodes of something. <laughs>
that set the other day. Take a look at it. Good size coon. Nice dark one. Hey, that one doesn't look rubbed either. Really kind of surprised. Hey, these dog proofs really they do a good job. Yeah, about this is probably it might have stayed about 30 degrees last night. Good weather for him to get out and get moving. I know. Yeah, here's a coon. There's another male. It's weird how I went through a period where they were all rubbed, and now I'm getting back into better looking coons. Went ahead and pulled that trap. I don't think I'll. Sorry. I don't think I'll set any more coon traps this year. But it's a pretty nice one. I'm sure he's full of fleas every yeah he is a little rubbed. It's not horrible. We'll put him up anyways. But moving on, hopefully we'll have a coyote here in a little bit. All right, guys. See one jumping around. Not at this newer farm that I set up. And finally connected with one. Must be a pretty good sized coyote. It's a pretty one. It's healthy. Looks like a good catch. About that time, it yanks his foot out and gets away. That's a good looking dog. Get this the pellet rifle loaded here. Man, it's a good looking guy. Come on, buddy, talk. Got two more traps on down that way. Be nice if we get a couple more coyotes. He's in good shape. Easy. Easy. Get him taken care of. Easy. He is a nice one. We'll walk on down here. I don't bring the four wheeler on this farm. Well, I do occasionally, but typically I just try to walk it because they're kind of picky on their hay field. Especially when it's muddy like this, I don't like to get back here and track everything up. Good, 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 good. I finally, finally caught one out here, which I guess if I had traps out here for less than two weeks, I mean, overall. Originally, when I set it up, there was a trail that ran through here, coyote trail. I got two traps up here. I don't see anything there. Hopefully, I ain't got no thrown traps. Don't see any tracks either. Traps are good. At least that one is. We've got a flat set right there. We've got a dirt hole over there. Nothing in either one. 
Get up here and get this one out. Get that set remade. I might go ahead and just walk the rest of them and on the way back. Remake that one. Let's take a look at him. He's, he's a good sized dog right there. He's done. Uh, not rubbed. Yeah, he's a little bit, but not real bad. Man, it's a nice guy. Alright guys, we got him moved over. It's a male. Heavy. Uh, let's get this reset. Got some, got some scat back here. I'll put it up here in a minute. Still good. My dirt hole was right there. <sighs> muddy, muddy mess. B550 man, I love these traps. I like the Dukes, don't get me wrong, but those M those had some issues with the Dukes, the, uh, the levers bending on them. I don't know. that is but I've not had an issue with that with these MBs this isn't going to be perfect but she's solid it's just mud and you can only do so much once the ground turns the mush on you just bed them as solid as you can Hopefully I've got enough dirt. I have not refilled my wax dirt container. My portable one. I probably don't have enough. Yeah, maybe I do. I remember to refill this tonight. I think we can make that work. Very subtle backing, but it seems to work. I'm gonna get some turds there. There's a couple more. That's right there. And that's it. Ah. 
Oh yeah though, he's, he's really a nice guy. Luckily I don't have to carry him. 100 yards. Right through here. Ah. <sighs>